Just been feeding this tank uh, and some frozen foods. And so there's lots of little, uh, not debris, but food particles flying around, plus water changes due tonight or in the morning. Um, but I just wanted to show people that they're at it again. You might remember the little platinum parrots that I'm just um, so in love with, and I'd gotten a trio of those before. And uh, they had uh, built a nest, dug out a hole, and uh, they did not spawn. Uh, but they guarded that site uh, for several days. And now they're a little bit bigger, quite a bit bigger for them, but uh, they're, they're still small. Uh, but you see what, what they're doing there. Busy, busy, both of them. Um, and driving all the other fish away, the big fish too. <laughs> of course, the big fish are just like, you must be crazy. Um, it's gonna try to sex them for us, but I've forgotten which is the male, which is the female. But that guy there is starting to get really pretty. Some of my, uh, my geos are starting to become juveniles now. And they're going to be like that soon. Uh, but yeah, so we've got that going on again. And in other news with the platinum parrots, uh, that's the pair right there. They paired up pretty soon after I got them, so that left an odd man out. And Ed, Chattanooga Ed, let me know. There's the odd one there. I believe, yeah. That's the odd one there. Um, so Ed let me know that they had uh, three or four more in it. Uh, three, he said, at Ponds and Plants. Um, so there that guy is. So I went over there today. He offered to get them and bring them to me, but I wanted to get out. So I drove over today, and it turns out they had five of them, actually. <laughs> they have them separated because they consider them aggressive fish, and they're not at all. So, I had to constrain myself and get one, and I got the largest one they had, which is still smaller than, there's the one I already had, the odd man out, and that one that ran at him is the new one, him or her. So, I'm hoping, I guess the odds are 50-50, I don't know, that I'll have a, another pair there. Or at least they'll have a friendship so that that guy's not out. But you can see how much bigger they've grown. Uh, they were that size. Now he's going to hide now. They were that size when I got um, the three I've already got before. So, but the new one's eating. They're just really gregarious little fish. I'm still just sick about losing his mate never had a chance to mate because she got the air bladder issues when the tank burst and she was in the floor. I'm gonna knock you out if you hit one of my fish. I had mentioned that I uh, lost one of the, I don't know what happened to it, so with fish this size, these cerebrums never bother any of these other fish. They never run at these um, uh, hill stream trout, uh, but I did lose one of them. So I'm gonna go ahead and move the others over to the rainbow tank before lights out tonight. Uh, not sure which rainbow tank yet, but just with something closer to their size. Um, they're all across the top there. Uh, they've just finished eating. I said I fed this tank, so I'm only seeing four right now, but there were five. They're doing great. Just one disappeared during the night, so you don't have to tell me again that they don't need to be in there again. Not while they're this small. It didn't jump. So this video is not about you, but you sure are handsome. He's not even, even fully grown yet. Just a big juvenile. 
that guy's going to look just like him, but I'm hoping that's a female <laughs> little parrotfish chased her away. All right, we're over five minutes. So.